start Windows Movie Maker. After that, you want to import videos. So you will click on Import Videos. Brings up a dialog box. Right now it's set for something other than where I want. Where you want to be is in My Documents. Within My Documents you want to be within My Flip Video Library. Open that. And then within My Flip Video Library I made up a I've saved my movies into what is called flip videos. That's where I saved them. You may have named it something else. I created a Christmas tree video, a tiger video, and a person video. So what we're going to do is combine each of these three videos. So I will click on the Christmas tree one first and click on import. It will bring it into Movie Maker. So it's there. Now I will left click and drag it and bring it down to the timeline area below. So now the movie is there. It's a very short, it's only two seconds. We'll go back to import video. We'll take the tiger video this time. So we'll double click on that one. It's being imported into Movie Maker. Now it appears here. Now I left click and drag this one to be down alongside of the Christmas tree one and then I release it. And now I have two movie clips down in the timeline. We'll go back now to import video and we'll, and we'll pick up the person video. We'll double click on it to import it into Movie Maker. And now we will left click and drag and bring it down after the other one there and let go. And now we have three videos sitting in the timeline. So now we go down to finish movie, save to my computer. We'll click on that. Save to movie file. It has a name there of movie we can we can give this a name by overtyping the word movie under one there and this is a um, tutorial we'll do that this is tutorial for combined binding videos that'll be the name of our video tutorial for combining videos we'll go down now we leave this alone choose a place it's gonna put it in my videos my videos is it's within my documents see it's within my documents my videos so that's where it's going that's where movie maker would normally put it so we'll go down and we'll click on next <clears throat> this is the movie setting normally you leave it if you want to save it and uh, a movie maker creates an M, a WMV file from the AVI file and it's usually about one-third or less of the space so therefore we'll leave this at best quality for playback this particular one now will take 1.31 megabytes the combined the three of them they're very short videos normally your videos would be much longer than that so then I click on next and then up here it'll show you estimating time remaining it's five seconds remaining it finished now All right. you have successfully completed the save movie you could close out Windows Movie Maker I'll do that now because we don't need it anymore so I click no now I can go up to my documents I can double click on this and open it up you go down to my videos and open that up yeah in this case it's at the end this is where it is it's now an M WMV file and this is the combined video it's 1.2 megabytes long so that is how you combine several videos into one video 
Now it is in my documents and my videos.